Welcome to GoToGroup's demo of the ConnectAll product. ConnectAll will help your ALM teams align, integrate, and accelerate. GoToGroup has been business over 10 years. We're a platinum partner with GoToGroup. Our headquarters are in Baltimore and we have other offices around the world. The partners we work with are Atlassian, Hewlett Packard, Perforce, and MuleSoft, in addition to others. We have many clients, uh, both small and large. Uh, over a thousand we've helped deploy Atlassian products over the last seven years. On the services side of the company, we install, customize, and train Atlassian products. We also have a software development side of the company that primarily creates integrations between Jira and other products such as HP Quality Center, Salesforce, Doors, and Perforce. Our ConnectAll product is not a point-to-point -point application like you previously saw, but they're multi-point. So you can connect multiple Jira instances with Quality Center instances, with uh, Doors instances, etc. I'd like to show you a demo of the ConnectAll product. The first step in ConnectAll is the mapping GUI. So this maps applications between uh, one application to another. In this particular uh, setup of ConnectAll, you can see that we have numerous applications that already have been mapped between uh, a standalone Jira to an on-demand Jira, a Jira to ClearQuest to Doors, etc. We support all the following products Quality Center 11 and 10, Jira 4, 5, and 6, including the on demand version of Jira, Perforce, TFS, CPine, Doors, ClearQuest, and Rally. I'm going to show you an example of how we created a mapping between a standalone Jira and an on demand Jira. You can see the mapping defines the two different servers and the projects that's going to be synchronized. So for exa this example, we can see that we're mapping a downloaded version of Jira with uh, a Jira on-demand system. And we're synchronizing the data between uh, this project, a Jira on-demand, in our downloaded instance to the Jira project on our on-demand instance, and we're synchronizing the bugs. We can synchronize any fields that are available between the two applications, whether they're standard fields, custom fields, comments, or attachments. Showing the modify application link, you can see that there's no need to enter any data. It's all point and click. So for example, here I can see all of the fields that are available in our downloaded Jira. And on the right side, I can see all the fields that are available in the on-demand Jira. And to add a new field, it's as simple as clicking on a field on the left side, clicking on a field on the right side, and then uh, selecting should the field be synchronized in both directions, uh, one direction or in the other direction the field is added to our synchronization list by hitting the plus button. When we do that, we now have our new list of fields here and we can see some fields are mapped. In other words, the values are mapped between the two systems because they may not have the same values. The mapping is easy to create. Again, there's no reason to type in data. All of the information is point and click. So we can see all the values that came over from your Jira systems. When you are, have finished creating your mapping and you want to save it, click Save and you enter your check-in comment. All of the changes are versions so that if you want to go back to a previous version, it's as simple as clicking on Load Version and we can see all the previous values that were available. In this instance, there were two uh, one previous, two previous versions that were created. Also, when you first create your first mapping, instead of entering all the fields in from scratch, you might try the load defaults. That allows you to put in the default values 
of what we see as the most commonly synchronized fields between uh, your applications. In this example, the fields for Jira are like summary and description, assignee, reporter, status, for example. And we've also put in the most frequently mapped values. Though for your particular system, these values may be different and you feel free to modify them as you need to. So in addition to the field mapping, we're also mapping entities. So we're mapping particular projects and particular issue types. So if you have multiple projects or multiple issue types you want to synchronize, you would just create another application link. Additionally, we also have some advanced properties. Uh, for example, if you want to synchronize not the entire attachment, but only a URL, then you can use uh, this definition to define, do you want the URL to be displayed in HTML or a uh, wiki text or uh, just a plain uh, attachment name. You also can define the synchronization user. That user only needs permission to browse, create, and edit issues in the applications. Um, you also have poll queries. So for example, you don't want the entire uh, all the issues in the project to be synchronized. Uh, maybe all the issues except for new issues. So you could uh, create a poll query to do something like that. And then also, uh, last of all, time difference. Uh, by default, when you install ConnectAll, it starts synchronizing all the new data that's in your applications. But maybe you want to start synchronizing all the data from a year ago. So you could enter in a date time here start synchronizing from that date format. The license configuration for ConnectAll is by your application servers. So you might have uh, three HP servers and two Jira servers. So you would buy a ConnectAll license for each. Um, if you would like to try an evaluation of ConnectAll, uh, please send an email to sales at GoToGroup and we would be glad to help you with setting up an evaluation. So that's how you map your applications. Now let's look at how that affects your applications themselves. When you're using ConnectAll in an environment between multiple applications, your users do not really see any difference in using the application. Of course, you may uh, display the issue links between the applications if you want. And of course, if users are synchronizing comments or attachments, they'll see that uh, change in data and information inside their applications, which of course is a useful feature of ConnectAll, is to aid collaboration. For example, you might have uh, one team is using a downloaded version and another team is using the on-demand version, but they have a common Jira project they want to keep synchronized and communicate and collaborate with each other. You can use ConnectAll to uh, synchronize the comments between the two systems so that the two teams can see what's going on with this particular issue. So to use the product, it's as simple as using the issue like you always use it. You just create a, a new issue, like maybe a new bug. And then in about a minute, when uh, ConnectAll runs, it'll synchronize the information over to the other application. And like I've said previously, all standard fields are synchronized in addition to custom fields, comments, and attachments. That's the demo for ConnectAll. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us. You can reach us at uh, sales at gotogroup.com and you can also look at the documentation available for GoToGroup. Go to www.gotogroup.com slash products. Thank you for joining our demo today and we hope to hear from you soon.